Our fridges are funny things, aren't they? We put our food in there to keep it cool, to keep it fresh, to make it last longer. But how often have you come back to that half a jar of pesto and it's gone all mouldy or right at the back of the fridge there is this sort of uh, squidgified carrot that's been sitting in there for months and months and months. We love our fridges and our freezers because they mean food lasts for longer means there's less food wastage but it also allows us to put stuff in there to forget about it and for it to fester and to go moldy. I wonder if there are things in your life that you have put in there that you haven't really looked at recently you've kind of forgotten about and they've started to fester and go moldy maybe rhythms and practices maybe things you do habits that you have that you don't ever really think about. Maybe that thing you do where you first just pick up your phone in the morning and swipe to whatever social media, and that's the first thing you look at. Or maybe it is uh, an unhealthy obsession with the news, uh, especially in this current climate where there's so much news constantly coming at us. Maybe that unhealthy habit that you've just sort of forgotten about, that you see every day in your daily life, like when you open the fridge, you don't really notice that mouldy jar of pesto because it's been in there so long. Maybe it's time to look at each of the things in your life and work out what is still tasty, what is still good. These freshly made sort of uh, mini Spanish omelets made by Rebecca the other day, they're still tasty and delicious and they're worth eating, they're worth uh, engaging with. But what are those mouldy jars of pesto in your life? Those things that have gone putrid, that it's worth looking at and getting rid of, quite frankly. Things that are unhealthy, things that are causing you distress. Look at them, get rid of them.